Hundreds of frontline workers have attended a demonstration in Darwin to protest the Northern Territory government's four-year pay freeze. Teachers, corrections officers and firefighters are among those taking industrial action. They marched into Parliament House with a message for the Labor government. Who's got the power? We've got the power! Teachers, corrections officers and firefighters joined the strike over the government's four-year pay freeze. As a member of the Labour Party, I'm devastated with the way they are treating ordinary working men, women. Instead of a pay rise, the government has offered public servants $10,000 in cash bonuses spread over four years. We will not fold over with those who see this short-term bloody shut-up money that they call a bonus as anything but a joke. Unions say the pay freeze will see essential workers head interstate for a better deal. They're in a situation where they need to decide do they stay here in the Northern Territory or they go elsewhere because the, all the other state and territory governments are giving considerable wage increases. Nurses and midwives are also considering industrial action as they struggle with a crippling workload. They feel like their registration's on the line. They feel like they can't give the best quality care to their patients and they are scared. Chief Minister Natasha Files is at the Federal Government's Jobs Summit in Canberra and none of her Labor colleagues attended the rally. The country Liberal Party leader Leah Finocchiaro and her colleagues were there. My CLP team and a CLP government, if we're successful in 2024, does not support any public servant having their pay freeze. So far, the Files Labor Government has refused to budge on its pay freeze for public servants, but with this many turning out at today's rally, many of them core Labor Party supporters it's hard to see the maintaining that position. You can take your wage freeze and shut We are not going to tolerate this from a Labor government. If you don't lose a wage freeze, expect to lose the next election. Matt Cunningham, Sky News, Darwin.